Hey there, my name is Christina and today I'm going to unbox and review the Our Place Tiny Cast Iron Skillet. I've been looking for clean or cleaner products after I was diagnosed with stage 1 thyroid cancer this year. And thankfully it was all removed in surgery but ever since I have been adjusting my lifestyle to lead a healthier one. I have seen so much about the Our Place Always Pan on social media and YouTube but when I saw this on their website I knew I had to have this first. I haven't seen any reviews or videos using the tiny cast iron, so I thought I'd make one on it to help anyone looking to purchase it. The price of this tiny cast iron is $60, and I ordered the lavender color, and let me tell you guys, it does not disappoint. It is a small cast iron measuring 6.5 inches in diameter, and it is a bit heavy, weighing 2.4 pounds. Honestly, I was nervous of using this little skillet as it is the first time I was using a cast iron anything in my life. But this is perfect for newbies like me because it has a matte black enamel interior, meaning you don't need to season it as much. On that note, this is not dishwasher recommended and it is actually best to hand wash with warm soapy water and a non-abrasive sponge. I am washing and seasoning this skillet before using it as it is recommended in the little pamphlet it came with. As you can see, I'm a complete newbie, so YouTube and the pamphlet helped a lot. I learned it is actually best to use low to medium heat on the stove in order to preserve the enamel coating, but this little bad boy is oven and broiler safe up to 500 degrees Fahrenheit. It is made without potentially toxic materials like PFAs, including PTFEs, PFOAs, lead, and cadmium, which are actually harmful materials for our bodies. The only downside to this pan is that I wish it came with a lid to finish cooking certain foods like my eggs, but where there's a will, there's always a way. Also, the handle can get hot, so I definitely recommend getting the silicone guards, but I used my oven mitt, so it was completely fine. So after wiping the excess oil and seasoning my cast iron, it's time for the test. I find that the ultimate test has to be eggs as it is the easiest food to stick onto pans. I used butter to grease my pan, I kinda overdid it, but it's okay. Then when the pan was to the perfect temperature, I poured in my lightly seasoned eggs and added feta. I put a lid on to cook my eggs and then did the flip test and it was perfect. I also did the slide test and again perfect because nothing stuck on it and it was super easy to clean. Overall, I definitely recommend this pan even if you're a newbie like me. So if you're looking to purchase this, I'll leave a link for you in the info box down below. I hope you enjoyed this video as well as I hope it helped and please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content like this one. Bye!